they've really come together there. Mm -hmm. We are still hoping. We are rain still might. hoping. Yeah. <laughs> we'll put it that way. It's uh, There's some rain out there, but it's just well to our south. Okay. It's down near the San Antonio area right now. So a forecast of for the rest of your evening looks something like this. Right now we have overcast skies. It's still very mild, very humid, and not a lot on the radar here locally, but can't rule out the scattered shower or storm overnight and everything will wrap up by tomorrow morning. So by noon, you'll see a little sun peeking through. We'll be right back in the mid 70s. Let's take a look at the radar. We all the areas in yellow are still under that severe thunderstorm watch until 1 a.m. There's a weak front stretched right across the Austin region. That's kind of the focus for some of this weather. Unfortunately, just nothing has really developed along that front that's really gotten going this evening. So still quiet here in Austin. The green you see there on the radar, that is actually just a little radar clutter. Nothing falling from the sky. Zooming to the south a little bit, though, that's where that stronger weather really is. San Antonio about to get hit with another round of storms, but the bulk of the activity stretches from Houston to San Antonio, just south of our region. So why is this all happening? There's that weak front that I was talking about right near the Austin area, kind of providing the, the emphasis for a little of those storms to develop, but nothing really getting going in our region. Can't rule out one or two more storms overnight tonight, and there's still the potential that they could become strong to severe, but it's becoming less and less likely as we go further into the evening hours, especially as this front becomes weaker and maybe drifts a little bit further south. So hour by hour through your forecast, here's 1115 tonight. You see the uh, strongest activity staying to the south of our region. I think it might even be a little further south than what this model is showing. This right now shows it over a uh, San Marcos, Lockhart, LaGrange area. Already it's further south than that. As we go forward into the overnight hours, everything weakens after midnight and then by early tomorrow, maybe a scattered shower or two and everything wraps up early morning hours here in the Austin area. By the afternoon, we'll see those clouds breaking up, a little sunshine out there, and it's going to be another pretty warm and humid day. Cloudy skies right now, 76 degrees overcast and 74 out of ABIA. Our winds are out of the north and east, as you see that front just to the south and east of the Austin area. Very light out of the airport. Temperatures in the mid-70s across the board. Tonight will only fall into the low and mid-60s. And for tomorrow, with the afternoon sunshine, Another warm day. We'll be right back in the low 80s. So tonight I'm keeping that chance of a storm in there. It's only about 20% though now 64 degrees overnight. Tomorrow everything wraps up 82 early in the day. A little more sunshine during the afternoon and your seven day forecast. Check out the rain chances that continue all the way through Thursday. Small chances Monday, Tuesday for maybe an afternoon shower or storm. Wednesday, Thursday, it's going to be a late Wednesday into early Thursday as another cold front moves in.